tell the story of Freeport in Indonesia is a difficult one. It's been the source of at least two entire books. It's uh, one of the largest single uh, projects in Indonesia, and it's in one of the most socially, environmentally, politically complicated parts of Indonesia. What we've seen here is the development of a small but technically complicated open pit, a relatively small underground reserve, and then after that, the discovery of Grassberg, one of the largest ever open pit resources in the world. And we're now transitioning to become one of the largest uh, underground miners in the world. At this moment, most of the ore comes from Grassberg open pit mine and the mine will be closed in 2017. That's why we have to prepare our future mine from underground considering the ore deposit is more in underground for our ore supply to the mill in the future. So that's why we are preparing project in underground mine to align with that plan. När det gäller gruvdriften, där hanterar vi själva transporten av malmen under jord. Och det är ganska stora sträckor som blir. I GVC-delen kommer vi sätta in ett tågsystem för att transportera malmen. Vi jobbar med Mid Rock Remote Mining Solutions. Och det innebär ju att vi försöker styra allting utanför gruvan. Vi behöver ingen personal under jord för själva produktionen. Det enda personalen som behövs under jord det är underhåll, vilket gör att det blir en väldigt säker lösning. Och I och med att det är fullautomatiserat också så blir det väldigt effektivt. Det krävs väldigt lite personal för att hantera det. För en operatör kan hantera väldigt många olika lastningar, för de behöver inte ske samtidigt och de går väldigt snabbt. När han har lastat färdigt på ett ställe så kan han bara växla över till nästa utan att förflytta sig och jobba på samma ställe. We went to Karuna to learn about their trains and from there we, we saw some of the things that they were doing and we said well let's take it to the next step and go one step further, let's automate even more than just the trains. So we, we talked to Midrock about helping us pull it all together and they pulled all the technologies together from conception to implementation in about three years. If we would have done it in-house, it probably would have taken us 10 to 20 years to pull it all together. It wouldn't have worked because they brought in a lot of expertise. They had some experience and they were able to understand what we were looking for. We see Midrock as a long-term partner here. They've helped us get started and we see this going forward as always trying to advance us to the next level. We've got to stay ahead of the curve on technology, and we think that Midrock is probably that company that's going to help us do that.